Welcome to Agriculture Academy, where we show you how to start a profitable business in agriculture. Remember to like and subscribe so that you never miss out on any new videos. In this video, we are going to take a look at some of the sheep breeds that you can rear. Generally, sheep are classified as meat or wool producers. However, many breeds are suitable for both. With that in mind let's get into it, here are 10 sheep breeds that you can use in your production. Southdown. Bred in the UK during the late 1700s, the Southdown sheep is commonly reared for both its wool and meat. Southdowns are also valued for their use in crossbreeding to improve certain characteristics in other breeds. These sheep are medium to large in size and are clearly identifiable by their white wool and unique faces. The Southdowns are polled, which means they lack horns. Their wool is fine to medium with a fiber diameter of 23 to 29 microns. Suffolk. This breed was developed in the UK in the early 1800s when Norfolk ewes were crossed with Southdown rams. They stand out in a crowd with their black faces and woolless legs. Suffolk sheep are reared for their meat, specifically mutton, which makes this early maturing breed a favorite among producers. Unfortunately, the wool from Suffolk sheep is short and tarnished by the black hue. Like the Southdowns, these sheep are also polled. Black-headed Persian. The South African bred black-headed Persian has a fat tail, white body and a black face. These sheep have a hair-like coat as opposed to a woolly one and are therefore primarily reared for their meat. Because of this, this breed does not tolerate cold temperatures very well and thrives instead in hotter climates. Both the ewes and rams are generally polled. Dorset Horn. An endangered breed, the Dorset Horn is mainly reared for its meat or for conservation purposes. Both the male and female sheep have horns. Apart from their meat, the Dorset Horn can produce between 2 to 5 kilograms of medium graded wool per sheep per year. They can also be reared as dairy sheep. One of the most interesting aspects of this breed is their extended lambing season. This characteristic allows the ewes to lamb twice a year. Dorper. The Dorper is reared for meat production, primarily mutton. It is one of the most economically important sheep in South Africa after it was bred there by crossing Dorset horns and black-headed Persians. These sheep can have white or black heads and are perfectly adapted to withstand the arid conditions of Southern Africa. Dorper ewes can lamb up to three times a year and are therefore a breeder's dream. To achieve this, however, a breeder needs to be experienced in correctly selecting weaned lambs for breeding purposes. Lincoln also known as the Lincoln Longwool, this breed was developed to have the longest and most gleaming coat of all sheep. The Lincoln sheep are commonly exported from the UK and used to interbreed and improve the coat quality of other sheep. They are one of the largest breeds and will produce a lean carcass when reared for their meat. The Lincoln sheep are heavy feeders and should be grazed on lush pastures. Due to their thick coats, they are suited to colder areas and can withstand dry conditions too. Merino. Merino sheep are one of the best breeds and are forerunners in both wool and mutton production. They are favored for their high quality, medium to fine wool which offers natural UV protection and breathability at competitive prices. Merino mutton is lean, succulent and flavorsome. The sheep are medium sized and can be polled or horned. Merinos are hardy, resilient and adapted to most environmental conditions. Isle de France. These sheep have large, smooth bodies and are mostly reared for their mutton, however, they can produce wool of medium quality and pure color. Their wool quality can be improved when the rams are crossed with first-generation merino ewes. These sheep can also be reared for milk production. The ewes mature early and can breed out of season, allowing them to produce three lambs every two years. These sheep are hardy and can withstand both hot and cold climates and are an ideal breed for novice sheep farmers. Hampshire Down. Hailing from the UK, the Hampshire Down was bred in the 1800s when South Downs were crossed with the old Hampshire sheep. They have large, black bodies that are covered with white fur. Hampshire Downs are most commonly reared as meat sheep. They are extremely resilient and can adapt to almost all climates. This energetic breed have a long breeding season and the ewes commonly give birth to multiple lambs at a time. Cheviot one of the oldest breeds on this list, the Cheviot sheep are believed to date back as far as the 1300s. Cheviot sheep are highly adaptive, being able to thrive in both cold and hot, as well as wet and dry climates. A large breed, these sheep produce copious amounts of white, fuzzy wool which is very durable. Cheviot sheep are low maintenance, especially when it comes to lambing as the ewes are capable and attentive mothers. And there you have it, our list on the top sheep breeds that you can consider rearing. 
Thank you for watching and see you next time.